there welcome back to my channel this is going to be a haul video so I've been vlogging this weekend and I went to several stores and I wanted to show you what I purchased so I needed to purchase a pillow to stuff a bag that I purchased from coach <laughs> so I went into Michael's and I picked up this premium pillow this retails for $14.99, however, with the discounts, I think I had like a 60% off coupon. I got it for like $4, which is awesome. So this is going to go inside of one of the other purchases that you're going to see. I did go into Kohl's. I picked up a pair of jeans that I can't show you because I'm actually wearing them right now. But they are the... They were actually Levi's. I've never had Le Levi jeans before, but they fit really well. Uh, and they're called Lee Motion Series Total Freedom Eased Fit. And I don't know, they're very comfortable. I don't know if like I'm at a point in my life where like I no longer need like sexy jeans, you know, like very tight jeans. I just need jeans that fit me properly. Like, you know what I mean? Like I don't, I don't need to have the super skin tight skinny jeans or anything like that. So these jeans fit me very well. I'm very happy with them. Sorry, I can't show them to you, but they're jeans. You, they're jeans. I also needed a new belt and I picked up a belt, a uh, chaps belt. And it is a reversible belt. So on one side it just has this like snake, snake skin type of print and it's black. And then on the other side it's just, uh, just brown. So I liked that. I liked that it, that you get two belts for one essentially. So I picked that up. Then I picked up a ring that was on clearance. So it was a $10 ring and it's just rose gold full of little, you know, little diamonds. Obviously not real diamonds, but I thought it was really cute and really pretty. So I'll just uh, wear it on my ring finger. And I thought it was really cute. So this is from the company Floor. And it retails for $50, but it was on sale on clearance for $10. So we came across this interesting little store. So the store is called Flying Tiger Copenhagen. So this is, this is the business card. And it just has, I don't know, I guess it's a, it's a Swedish company. It says, uh, it says Halaj. I think that's Swedish for high. It's very, it had like a very Ikea feel. It, oh my God, I'm sitting here talking to you guys and my cat is chewing on the drawstring for the purse that I just bought. Oh my goodness, crush. Ugh. So that sucks. Let me continue. It had an Ikea feel to it. Very cool little things in there. So let me show you what I got. I saw these little pencils. Blyanter, Bl Blyanter pencils. They're black pencils, but on the top they had these little jewels on it, like uh, like pen gems, pens, and I thought they were so cute. So I picked them up for myself, and then my girlfriend saw on my Insta stories, uh, my friend Cindy. Hi, Cindy. She saw that I got that, and she was like, "Oh my God, those are so cute!" So what did I do? I went back and I bought her a pack, and then. I bought another pack for another one of my girlfriends, so <laughs> I went a little pencil crazy. But they're so cute with their little their little gems on top and yeah, so picked up three of those. I picked up one the one day and then I actually went back the next day. If you take a look at my last vlog, you'll you'll see that I went back to the store. Or I went back to the mall rather just to get those pencils and then I wound up shopping a little more. But anyway. Also I got this giant eraser for my son. He wanted it. He was with me. And it says for really big mistakes, <laughs> which I thought was funny. So yeah, so that, so that's from that store, Flying Tiger Copenhagen. Okay. So then I went into Henry Bendel. Now I'm going to be taking a trip this coming weekend and I wanted a nicer kind of toiletry case. So from Henry Bendel, even the little toiletry bag has its own little dust bag. I think that's so cute. I picked up this adorable pouch. 
and just says Henry Bendel and script on the top it says Henry Bendel New York so it's their signature brown and white stripe with orange type trim and it's really cool because when you open it so it has this kind of shape to it when it's closed but when you open it it expands to be just a complete uh, rectangle so I just I thought that that was so awesome inside it has uh, it's orange and it has that wipeable material so anything you put in here makeup whatever it'll be fine you don't have to worry about it getting dirty because you could just very easily wipe it clean and so this is called striped canvas dop kit in the large size and the color is called pureed pumpkin <laughs> and so it was $48 yeah $48 so that's that's the skew there the information or whatever and they had a bag that was maybe a third this size, the same exact uh, color combination and everything. And I, I wanted to pick that one up too, but I didn't really think that I would use it for anything, so I didn't. Uh, but yeah, I really love this. I can't wait to use it. I'm going to be filming a How I Pack My Keep All coming up, and I will show you what, what all I put in here. It does have a nice little pull tabby thing. I don't know what it's called y'all know so yeah so I got that very cute very excited to use this that was the one day I went and then I went back I went back and I picked up some jewelry so this is my first Henry Bendel jewelry purchase out of this pouch comes this beautiful bracelet and I just fell in love with the flirtily look to it crushy get down and it's gold and silver so the little flirtilies are silver and then it has i don't know if you can see that has four little gold rivets on it and this is the the closing uh mechanism to it it's like the tiffany uh, i forgot what this type of closure is called but that's the type that it has in it. So it has three, three uh, settings for it. So you can make it really small or large. And I absolutely loved it. And so I picked that up. And this is called the Petal Metal Bracelet in gold. And it's very tiny. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that. But this retails for $88. I think it's, it's so pretty. Very, very pretty. And so what did I do? So I picked up the matching necklace. So it's the same exact, same exact thing with the little flirtily flowers, the gold band. I don't remember what this kind of mechanism is called, but I picked up the matching uh, necklace. So it's just a double. It's just like the double uh, double necklace. I don't, this has a name, doesn't it? It has a name where you have like two two levels. I don't know, y'all. But I thought it was pretty. So I picked up the set. And this one, I'm assuming it's called the same thing. Yes, it's called the Petal Metal Collar in gold. And the cat is here. Hi. Do you like the Henry Bendel necklace? Yeah, he likes it. He says it smells good. Oh, I'm sorry about the background noise. Our neighbors are outside playing basketball. But yeah, so I picked up the little set. And because I spent over a certain amount of money, I don't remember what that dollar amount was. Oh, sorry, the necklace. So rude of me. The necklace retails for $138. I don't know if you can see the price on that and they were having a 10 percent sale and i found out some really sad information so the lovely client advisor she told me that henry bendel is going to get away from from sending people coupons in the mail because they want to start competing with brands like louis vuitton and gucci and chanel and things like that where they don't go on sale they will have from time to time promotions where you might get like 10 percent off and things like that but they're not going to have bigger sales than that which is sad but 
I mean, I get it. You know, they're they're trying to be on par with these other uh, fashion houses. But yeah, so got that information from them. But so I spent a certain amount of money and they were having a little promotion where they were giving away these cute shirts that said hashtag Bendel Girl. So you could either get it. It's It was a white t-shirt. You could either get the writing in black or the writing in glitter gold. However, I put the shirt up to myself and it was not going to fit me. So I said, well, you know, unfortunately, this isn't going to fit me. She said, oh, no problem. If it doesn't fit you, pick out any of the candles. So I smelled all the candles. They are all so lovely smelling, but I went with the peony candle. And this candle, does it have the size? 9.4 ounces. So, yeah. I'm not really a candle burner. I really, I'm a little paranoid of leaving the candle lit and then having a disaster happen. So I don't really burn candles. I wish I could because I, I, I love the smell of candles, but... I'm just going to keep this out and, you know, just let it scent the room on its own without burning it. Um, but yeah, so I picked this. You can smell it through the box. It's so fragrant. So I got a free candle, which is lovely. That's it for Henry Bendel. Then I went to coach. So the first day I went to coach and I picked up one thing. And... Actually, I'm going to show you the... the the second day that I went, I picked up a little something. I'll show you that first. So I have my little my little proof of purchase here. Put that on the side. Here's a little sticker, which I love. So cute. I don't want to break that seal, so I'm just going to pull it out. I got this beautiful, beautiful scarf. I'm actually going to wear it today. We're, we're going to head out to my mother-in-law soon, but... Unfortunately, I can't show you the whole thing, but it has these beautiful little roses, these little flowers all over it. And then it has a uh, leopard print as well, which I thought was so pretty. And so it's big. It's, it's comparable to the Louis Vuitton shawls, but this is a very thin one. So this is definitely a spring kind of scarf. And so the details on this one are MRG Patchwork OSQ. I'll just I'll just show you guys. And it retailed for a hundred and hundred and ninety-five dollars. And so it says seventy percent silk. Sorry, seventy percent cotton, thirty percent silk. Dry clean only. Yeah. So I just I thought it was lovely I will model it for you just on my neck oh and it does say it does have coach written on the on one of the corners in like the leopard print which I thought was really cute I'm not usually a leopard print uh, kind of girl but the sales lady the uh, the client advisor she was actually the one that said oh you know this might look really nice on you with your complexion or whatever but isn't that so pretty i just think it's so dainty and feminine and i don't know i just think it's so pretty it's so pretty anyway so that's a scarf my cat thinks i'm playing a game and he wants to get in on the action no dill hole no jerk stay away you didn't listen to me. Mommy's not playing a game. Mommy's trying to put this away. It's not a toy. That's so cute. Every so often, you'll see a flower that says coach underneath it, which I thought it was a really cute touch. Okay, and last but certainly not least, I did buy a handbag. It did come in this large coach shopping bag. And in this beautiful dust bag, which the cat already destroyed. <laughs> I got... 
a beautiful black tote. I think it's so pretty. It's got this like pebbled, pebbled leather to it. So this is called the Market Tote. And it retails for $295. Sorry about the camera shaking. And so it has these leather straps. It has this leather strap with a turn lock. You turn the lock to release it. And inside is this lovely red lining. Lovely, lovely red lining. And it has this pocket here that's... It's not removable. It seems like it would be removable, but it's not. And it's just like this kind of flap kind of pocket there, a zipper pocket. You all know that I've been looking for a black tote and I had the YSL in mind. I had the Neverfull MM and Epi leather in mind, but when I saw this, I thought to myself, Coach knows what they're doing. Coach has been around for quite some time and Coach's bags or well, their, their leather line I can personally vouch for they have wonderful leather they have wonderful products and I'm not saying I'm never gonna go back to Louis Vuitton never say never but I am certainly taking a break from it for a while the amount of money that we pay for these items and then the quality is not what it should be it just kind of turned me off to purchasing certain things at certain prices. And so I think that this bag is a beautiful bag. It serves its purpose. I'm going to get a lot of good use out of it at a fraction of the price of other brands. Like I said, never say never. I'm not saying I'm never going to buy high, higher end uh, designers, but I'm very happy with brands like Henry, ben Henry Bendel or Henry Bendel. I'm not really sure how you say it. Uh, with coach um, and so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm I was just talking to my friend BB about this uh, Hi BB if you're watching this we were talking about the fact that you know We miss the days of just buying something because because we think it's prettier because we think it's cute I really want to get back to that part of myself where I would just walk into a TJ Maxx or anywhere See something cute and say oh, I like that. I'm gonna get that for myself, but I'm just saying I'm glad that I came back to, you know, brands that don't cost an arm and a leg. These aren't these aren't cheap things. However, they don't carry the same price tag as other brands. And so I'm very happy with my purchases from Henry Bendel. I'm very happy with my purchase from Coach. And I look forward to what else is next uh, for me to buy. Although, I think I'm going to put myself on... A no spend for a good three months at least so in the month of April May and June I will not be purchasing any like luxury things let me just let me just say that I won't be purchasing purchasing any luxury things I won't say that I'm not gonna spend anything you know that I'm not gonna spend any money for the next three months because that's not realistic but as far as luxury high-end things purses wallets things like that I think I'm good I think I'm good and I'm going to pump the brakes a little bit and just enjoy using what I have. Sorry, my camera cut out on me. So yeah, so that might mean that there are going to be reviews coming up and just different kinds of videos as opposed to seeing unboxings and things like that. Like I said, I'm, I'm happy with my purchases. I can't wait to start using these items. And there are definitely things that I want to pick up from both of these brands, actually Coach and Henry Bendel. But We'll see. We'll see when those things happen and yeah, but in the meantime, I'm going to enjoy what I have. So yeah, anyway, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you'd like to subscribe, I'd love that too. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!